Hello there and welcome to lower 6 maths here with practice paper D. Here we're working on question 3, a log space question. Solve, geomet solve algebraically this uh, polynomial here. So these uh, these 8 to the x minus 1s don't look particularly nice. So what I'm going to do to start this problem off is substituting y equals 8 to the x minus 1. So effectively we've reduced our problem now down to y squared minus 18y plus 32 equals 0. OK, and we now solve this and we'll bring the 8x minus 1 back in later. So I think we get here a minus 16 and a minus 2. So here we have y equals 16 and uh, y equals 2. Or in other words, 8 to the x minus 1 will equal 16 and 8 to the x minus 1 will equal 2. OK, so now what we have to do is we have to calculate these uh, powers of x here. So what we can do is we can take logs, and what I'm going to do is use my calculator to do the most of the work here. So x minus 1 equals log base of 8 of 2. So the base number on the power is now the base on the log, so that makes sense. They're both bases, they both go down as the base. And it's of 16 and of 2. OK, so get your calculator out. And the button you're looking for is the button um, 2 under the menu button under the integral symbol, just above the cos. Log base something of something else. So you get to type in your number that's the base, and you get to type in your number you're finding log of. So doing that, I get log 8 base 2 x minus 1 will equal a third. And the other one... We're going to get log base 8 of 16 is 4 over 3. And that kind of makes sense here. The cube root of 8 is 2. That makes sense. And then if you cube root 8, you get 2 to the power of 4 will give you 16. So therefore, now we need to add on 1 into both of these fractions here. So 4 thirds add 1, we get 7 thirds. And 1 third add 1, we get 4 thirds. So your two answers here, y, x equals 4 thirds and x equals 7 thirds, 5 marks.